hello friends you are must welcome to oj priority once again and if you are new in our channel so don't forget to subscribe us so must you are looking just below this video have a subscribe button so just press this so let's begin with this video now so first of all i am going to interact with you the operating system so let's welcome here so garuda linux is uh, providing you the different types of environment for your desktop so let's begin with it let i show you that things so this this is the environment which actually you are going to look at here first is KDE other is XFCE third is GNOME other is LXQT KWIN other is Wayfire that other is QTILE then Amor BSPWM I3WM and SWAY these are the desktop environment which are available here the other thing is there actually the language support by the garuda linux are too much so if you are um, fine in english hindi arabic italic so everything all the languages supportable are available in this garuda linux so this is the very best thing for the garuda linux that this feature is giving by the garuda linux and this is a open source platform which is freely there is a no cost of service the other specific spotlights we are going to see here the feature which are going to look at here in Garuda Linux so that is a easy installation which basically we uh, face, face, face problem in uh, just installing the operating system so in Garuda Linux it is too easy to install we make the install process simply by using the Calmeras installer which is both fast and easy to use the other features I am going to look show you here so you can see here unleash the beauty it means with hand-picked desktop themes appearing shell look and beautiful blur effect out of the box Garuda Linux never lets you down so it's the interface which is so fine and clear and beautiful which you can able to feel a very good and symptomatic here the other feature is BTRFS as the default file system with ZS TD compression it means here BTRFS is a modern copy on write file system for Linux aims at implementing advanced feature while also focusing, focusing of fault tolerance, repair and easy administration. The other feature I am going to show you here that is automatic snapshot out of the box using time shift. It means here you can access five recent snapshot directly from the grub while beings are rolling release distro. Our goal is to ensure that your system will not be left in auto bootable state after a problematic update. Thus we use the BTRF file system integrated with the time shift which employs on automatic snapshot features backing up the system configure before each update. The other feature I'm going to show you here that is GUI for the package management, PMAC, and other is GUI for the managing driver and kernel that means Garuda setting manager, GUI tools for various common tasks that is Garuda assistant, GUI for grub boot option that is Garuda boot options, and uh, GUI for the network assistants and hotspot creations that is Garuda network assistant, GUI for the installation created gaming software that is a Garuda gamer. Features features are representing here rolling release Garuda there are the basically rolling release and Linux gen so the both are uh, unique but uh, the difference is there the two upper times of operating system Garuda Linux is a rolling reference distro based on the Arch Linux which in general allows setting the latest software updates we only use one extra reopen on the top of Arch Linux repos placing us very close to Arch Linux without having to install the system with CLI but in linux gen a faster more responsive linux kernel optimization for desktop multimedia and gaming result of collaborations collaborative efforts of the kernel hackers to provide the best linux kernel possible for everyday systems the other is use of uh, ease of use um, we use micro as the default terminal based text editor that's aimed to be easy to use on intuitive while taking advantage of the capabilities of modern terminals garuda linux offer you a various gui tool for system settings out of the box to make your jump start easier always free that's means open source gradual Linux will always be a completely free we create it to have a Linux based operating systems that is easy to use now focus of performance our goal is to provide a distro that focus only uh, on performance while making it beautiful that's why we made some sane performance tweaks 
first is improved io performance third second is cpu scheduler set to performs optimal installation power save tweaks other is jetram enables by default no hang on ohm prevention daemon as well as nnc which automatically sets nice level on our system the most important is no hang on ohms prevention daemon gorda linux does not not implement that time shift and btrf as a full backup um, full backup solution if you wish to ensure your data security you must implement your own full data backup regime gorda is not responsible in any way or manner if a data loss or loss occur the user is solely responsible for ensuring the safety of their own data likewise gorda cannot guarantee that time shift can recover your system to a functional state in the event of a serious system beverage so this is the thing which i have just show you here interact with you the gorda linux so gorda linux you have to download here so for simply downloading you have to click it here or may you can just click it here so both option were functionally Uh, work same so for the, uh, let i show you so for downloading you have to choose the language here if language you have, have to choose so, so there are so many languages if you belongs to the india and you like to choose hindi so in hindi language you also you can use this operating system if you would like to cho choose the another language english so may, you may would like to choose english also there are a lot of languages you are going to prefer to choose here so this is the best thing here now i show you the minimum requirement what minimum requirement your hardware have to install this uh, uh, operating system so 30 gb storage space for gb ram video card with open gl 3.3 or better 64 bit system now installation process procedure let i show you boot the pc and press the manufacturer's key to open the menus common uh, common key um, used escape delete f1 f2 f9 f10 f11 or f12 find more common key and buttons reset bios to factory default and reboot disable fast boot in bios setting go to security secure boot and disable the secure boot in the bios system make sure that the sata controller is set to be a ahci mode in a bios system if your firmware supports uefi then set your bios settings to uefi only create bootable usb using dd teacher ventry software if using rufus make sure to use dd mode to flash iso to usb from the firmware menu boot to drive while in uefi or bios mode you might see separate commands for the same devices for example you might see uefi usb drives and bios usb drives each command uses the same device and media but boots the pc in a different firmware mode we recommended to boot drive in a uefi mode it's if listed after booting live media start the installer and choose erase entire disk in the calmras installer the other is recommendations let i show you we do not support dual booting as it can lead to many potential problems regarding peripherals such as a wifi uh, boot um, bluetooth etc et uh, not working as well it might cause system to be unbootable after other operating system updates and grub in overwriting our distro is optimized for the performance on real hardware installing in virtual machine is not recommended as it might result in a bad experience we sacrifice extra ram to improve the responsive of the system we believe in the principle unused ram is wasted ram more information on some comma myths concerning ram usage if you wants to know how to install setup garuda linux was this short tutorials the link is available here we do not recommend the use of the snap or flat pack for software installation live session login detail username garuda password garuda so you can able to see here garuda kde d r 460 n i z e d addition of the garuda linux offer a dark blurry and full immersive plasma experience the workflow is mac like with a app menu backed right into the top bar and these are the download kde and dognized edition there is a kde dognized gaming edition and there is a dognized black arc edition these are the four uh, editions are available here you can just look it here what you feel good you can just download here the actually interface is look like this garuda xfce is a light waiting desktop environment for unix like 
operating system it aim to be fast and low on system resource while still being visually appealing and user friendly xfc is well known for being a rock solid and stable desktop environment the other i am going to look at here you can simply download here xfce edition now garuda linux junomi junomi is a modern desktop environment which is the both clean and beautiful it is a focused on easy of use for optimum laptop the juni edition used from prime rendering offloadings so for this purpose we are using so download gnome edition from this uh, button now go to the lxqt kvin x lxqt kvin is a lightweighted qt desktop environment that does not get in your way its focus lays on being a lightweighted leg free desktop with modern look and feel so you have to download from here download lxqt win editions so now i am going to interact with your garuda wayfire wayfire is a 3d leyland compositor impressed by a compass and based on wlr roots its aims to create a customizable expandable and lightweighted environment without sacrificing its appearance so you can download from here download wave editions and now i'm going to garuda qtly let i show you qtly is a dynamic extensible window manager which is easy to customize garuda qtly uses jg menus which make it very easy and convenient to launch application without remembering key buildings you can easily download here from here now i am going to show you garuda bspwm bspwm is a tiling window manager that represent window as the leave of full binary tree it only responds to x event and the message it's received on a dedicated socket so it's mean here you can download bspwm edition Garuda i3 WM it is a i3 WM is a lightweighted window manager that is operated exclusively with the keyboard our version has a simple and easy configuration with lx appearance to handle jtk themes we do ship the configuration with on easy cheat sheet to get you started due to light resource it has a really small memory for footprints the other is garuda csv Garuda Save Edition ships with a completed configuration with easy to use key buildings and a cheat sheet to help you uh, get started following the node color schemes it is the both good to look and adjust and just as fast utilizing the best of the wayland native alternatives to offer a uh, seamless transitions to the wayland compositors so directly you can download from here now advanced user only this is for the advanced user only so garuda linux bare bones garuda linux bare bone is made for user who do not wants extra software and functionalities and complain about blot it's contain only the bare minimum of package needed to get started you are on, uh, sorry you are on your own we don't provide any support for uh, bare bones addition so this is the things you can download from here in this also you are going to get two kinds of version download bare bone kde edition and download bare bone geomi edition so these are the way how you are going to download the multiple types of garuda linux operating system there are so many things are there if you wants to know something about extra about garuda linux so directly you can just go in the form menu and here you can just look it here there are so many things you can just put your um, faq so you may just going to get the feedback here now the other things i am going to show you about uh, the garuda linux which i already show you and the services which i already show you so let's uh, we are going to come in the main page home and here you can look it here for uh, reaching this uh, website you have to go in garudalinux.org so finally you are going to look at here the garuda linux and simply you can download here for your system as for your as requirement so hope you have uh, enjoyed this video lot and so much and everyone have the th uh, things to ask the question related about this video so there is a um, comment box you can directly comment in this box i will just uh, give you reply as soon as possible so thanks for watching us and don't forget to subscribe us if you are new in our channel so let's be going to meet you in the next video friends have a good look and have a good day thanks for watching us bye bye take care